Masami, it's such a pleasure to have you here today. It's a pleasure really to be here too. <laughs> so thank you for coming. And I know that you're doing an amazing work. You have started this beautiful project, Buy One, Give One, where you trying to educate the businesses and individuals about what it means to give back to the society and at the same time maybe making profit and, and sharing it. Can you tell me a bit more about how did it all start and why you decided to do this, please? Um, well, I think looking back, how it was started, how I started was um, uh, when I was younger, mm -hmm. I had the opportunity to travel around the world. And when I was visiting like in you know, so many different countries, then though I had uh, such a great time meeting with people, connecting and learning you know, new culture and everything, uh, while I was embracing all these experiences, I realized that uh, actually there are so many things happening in our world that I couldn't understand why. Because there were children who were on the street, um, or you know, people, dis people with disability not even having a safe place to be, or you know, uh, kids who cannot go to school. Mm -hmm. or, so I thought um, there was something like missing, but I didn't know what. And then many years later, um, I had my f daughter, and that was 14 years ago, actually, uh, nearly 15. And so when I held her in my arm, then uh, I felt so, so happy. And um, at that point, I kind of stopped. And then I looked at her and thought that actually my daughter could have been them. Like all the children I met, you know, the street kids and uh, people begging on the street. And um, so I thought if I wanted to do anything for my daughter, then maybe I could spend my life doing something a little bit more than just taking care of my own child or own family. So that like thing, that was the whole beginning. Then um, because I was passionate about food at that yes. point of time. <laughs> so the Japanese food is beautiful, <laughs> one of my favorites. <laughs> so I decided to start a food business. I worked as a chef at different restaurants and cafes and so it was very natural for me to start a food business because I believe that everybody in our world had a, you know should have opportunity to have a healthy food and then enjoy sharing that food with people they loved so uh, then we went in the business and eventually like six years on our food company became a food producer, we were producing packaged frozen meals and we were distributing this packaged food to um, more than 150 stores in Australia. So uh, looking back the very humble beginning, we were doing far better and we were growing. Mm -hmm. But then um, when we started, we had the idea that we wanted to give back, you know, to give the profit to, to help children around the world, but we realized that we were still being too busy, you know, we still didn't have enough funds or enough time or, you know, enough of everything to do what we wanted to do. So at that point of time, this simple concept came up for us, which was buy one, give one. So mm -hmm. what if every time we sold a meal, child received access to healthy meal? And we realized that there was amazing power in this concept because we often delay you know, our dreams and, and aspiration, thinking that we are not ready, we are not yes. successful enough, or we don't have enough money or enough time. But the thing is, if we only promise to do tiny little thing, then we could be doing that today and every day and through everything we did. So that buy one, give one concept brought the giving um, very close to business activities. Then one day we realized that it wasn't just about our business, but what if so many other businesses gave back in a way that they believed in. So education companies, you know, educating uh, a child or mm -hmm. uh, publishers planting trees every time they publish a book. Or what if, if all the businesses came together, maybe we could solve all the problems around the world. So that was the idea behind my own. Life is about balance, and music is been the factor that brought more balance to my life.